This season, the amazing race has a few surprises. You're no doubt aware of the high price of fuel these days. We can't exactly afford to have you driving and flying all over the world. So, first one around the block wins it. That's right, once around the block. Can we use mopeds? No. Down the street, four left turns, and back here. Ready? Go! Go! Okay. Okay. This is very really fun. The amazing fuel price awareness race. Tonight, only. Hi, everybody, and welcome to NSS and the Dave Reynolds Nooner. Do you know where your wife is? The action thriller Prey is the newest entry into the robust Predator franchise and will debut August 5th on Hulu. Set in the Comanche Nation 300 years ago, Prey tells the story of a young woman, Naru, played by Amber Midthunder, a fierce and highly skilled warrior. She's been raised in the shadow of some of the most legendary hunters who roam the Great Plains. So, when danger threatens her camp, she sets out to protect her people. The prey she stalks and ultimately confronts turns out to be a highly evolved alien predator with a technically advanced arsenal. While a severe pilot shortage in the U.S. has airlines scrambling for solutions, while well, you just stand by there, airlines, I'm going to go see Top Gun Maverick soon. I'm pretty sure I'll pick up enough training to fly a silly passenger jet. And no surprise to anyone, a new study found the way you perceive your drunken personality is way different from the way onlookers perceive it, especially when you take to the dance floor. <laughs> Here's Frank D'Angelo on the Dave Reynolds Nooner on NSS. Yes. 
you please tell me how to get over this? I just can't help it, your love I miss. Why is it that things always come to an end? No matter how hard I try, it just won't mend. What do I say every single day to make sure you're gonna stay, you're gonna stay? Well, Garth Brooks has postponed the on-sale date for an upcoming show in Buffalo out of respect for the tragedy the city experienced over the weekend. On Saturday, a racially motivated mass shooting in a supermarket claimed the lives of 13 people. Tickets for Garth's upcoming stadium tour show in the city were scheduled to go on sale Friday, but in light of recent events, Garth says he'll push the on-sale date to a later time to be announced in the coming weeks. The show itself will still take place as planned later this summer. Paramount Network announced Monday that production for Yellowstone Season 5 is underway in Montana. Season 5 will consist of 14 episodes split into two parts, which marks the longest season of Yellowstone to date. The hit show is expecting a late summer premiere. Apple has announced it is discontinuing the iPod Touch since it was the last iPod still available for purchase. This will mark the end of the entire iPod lineup. I guess you'll just have to play music on your phone now or maybe listen to us here at NSS. And according to a new poll, more than two-thirds of Americans are concerned about the threat of hackers. Of course, the bad news is the other one-third are actually hackers. (laughs) Here's Frank D'Angelo on the Dave Reynolds Nooner on NSS. It's Friday night. 
Got a fucking problem. See all day. Come on. Come on, man. We'll do you We'll do you go. We'll do you go. We'll have fun. Get up there and sing a song. The things you make me fucking do. Come on. Acting like a fucking old lady. Get up on this thing. Come on. Yeah. Let's have some fun. Fucking who fucking laughs? But you always make me do things I don't want to do. <laughs> you kidding me? You don't want to sing? What are you doing, Sonny? What are you doing? You're sing, right? You don't sing. You're another sign. Sit down. Go watch the fucking cheese. Come on. Sit down. Come on. Sing. Come on. Let's go. Hey, what are you doing? Wait. Whoa! I'm just a gigolo, and everywhere I go, people know the part I'm. Selling each romance Ooh, we'll just say it And there will come a day When you will pass away What will they say about me When the end comes, I know I'm just a gigolo Life goes on without me I'm just a gigolo And everywhere I go gigolo. People know the part I'm playing Pay for Selling each romance Ooh, what to say And there will come a day When you will pass away What will they say about me When the end comes, I know I'm just thinking alone Life goes on without me Cause I got nobody And nobody cares for me Sweet mama, please, come and take a chance with me, cause I'm a lonely baby, I've been a lonesome, well, I think so, leave it on the beat, on the beat, I'm a a bozy, bozy, boopsy, bop. Sorry, I gotta take this. Hello, honey. Pierre, where are you? I'm in a strip club. <laughs> Seriously, where are you? Yes, I'm in a strip club. What are you doing? I'm working. Okay. I love you. I love you too. I'll be home soon. You never lie, do you? No, I don't. You 
can give advice But you have my heart in a vice You can see out But you can never look within well, I always try To guide my way Out of this I always try To see myself You're so pure, you're demure, seems to me like you have no care. Okay, listen to me. I know your game, I think you're insane. You've been looking for fame, but let me tell you something. You're just another dame, and you're the same world. Unsure if you're aware of this terrible situation, but Hawaii is under siege from thousands of feral chickens. Citizens in Honolulu are complaining that the aggressive wild chickens have literally overtaken the community, defecating on properties, digging up yards and gardens, obstructing roads, roosting in mango trees, ripping up trash bags and scattering trash, foraging under walls and sidewalks, and seriously damaging local infrastructure. It's like a non-stop chicken spring break there. Not to mention the clucking and crowing from dawn until dusk. In the past two months, the city and county of Honolulu have set traps in five areas, but somehow only caught 67 chickens, costing $7,000. That works out to $104 per bird. What's that, 25 bucks a pound? Whole Foods is less expensive. Plus, the traps are being vandalized and stolen, though it's unclear who's damaging them and why. City officials are trying to address the public's desperate pleas for help while figuring out a cost-effective solution. You know, if only there was a natural predator of the chicken, something that not only eats chickens, 
but also robs their nests of the offspring, denying them a method of reproduction. If only, if only. You know what? The word rooster is only one letter away from the word roaster, if you're following my meaning here. Texans were asked to turn off their AC after sweltering heat knocked six power plants offline. In other words, the slogan, don't mess with Texas, was literally laughed at by the sun. Pope Francis just proclaimed 10 new saints, giving New Orleans the largest roster in the NFL. And health researchers say an average cinnamon pastry can have as much fat as two pork chops with mashed potatoes. And that's a problem because... Here's Frank D'Angelo on the Dave Reynolds Nooner on NSS.
See, maybe, uh, you know, you know, a little thing. We'll talk later. Inside the mirror, I know that there's nothing really left to fear. Cause I'm the one that's gotta deal with me. Me and he, that's one person. Cause I'm the guy when I go to bed and I wake up. I know that in the morning, I gotta pull all my strength and deal with the world. Because it's me against me and it's me against the world. And if you have one thing in your life while you walk this planet for this brief 